Hi, I'm Luke Andrew with Bentley Systems. In this video, I'll show you how to set up your spring hanger design in AutoPipe. I'm going to show you how to release anchors for spring selection, select the spring vendor, and run the spring selection. We have a simple model shown here that includes a spring that needs to be designed. Our first step will be to open the support dialog to ensure the settings are configured so that the spring will be designed by ensuring that the undesigned checkbox is checked and to set the load variation ratio to 0.25. The load variation ratio is a factor used in the spring selection to help limit the expansion stress. The load variation ratio is the cold preload minus the hot load, and that result is divided by the hot load. With that done, we can now go to the anchor dialog. We're going to release this support in the Y direction. This release will mean that the support in this direction is removed for the hanger selection procedure. It means that there will be more weight used in the selection process for the spring and is used to simulate disconnecting equipment so that the spring has the capacity to carry this weight. We will need to do the same process for the other anchor shown in this model now. Now we can set up the analysis for the spring hanger. We will set the rigid hanger criterion to 0 0.1. If the free thermal movement at a support is less than the rigid hanger criterion, then AutoPipe will select a rigid hanger or V-stop for that support. Next, we will set the spring manufacturer to Lysiga. We will set the design operation case to T1. We will include the pipe content weight. And finally, we will want to see the hanger report when the analysis is complete. Note, it is only possible to set these parameters and vendor in this way. The analyze all from the analysis ribbon tab will run whatever was last set in this dialog. With the spring hanger report open, we can see all the springs that meet the selection criteria and are listed in the report, and the first in the list is indicated with an asterisk. This indicates that this is the spring that has now been assigned to that support. We can double check this spring selection by double clicking on the spring at A10N to open the support definition dialog. The details of the spring from the hanger report are assigned to this support and we have completed the spring hanger design. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.